how does that old song go? Noah took the animals two by two. Here are the numbers you may need this week. 450 feet long, 75 feet wide, three decks, and 45 feet high. This is just in case you want to start scooping up those animals because we are looking at a significant amount of rain upcoming for this week. I'll have more on that in just a bit. First, we have high pressure in control of our forecast. You'll see it stationed off just to the south of portions of Louisiana. This is giving us an absolutely beautiful day, spring type weather, gorgeous temperatures, an amazing day. However, that is going to change for us. You'll notice out towards the west in California already starting to turn green. That is all the rainfall that is on the way and this system is going to move quickly. It's going to enter into our forecast really more Tuesday night into Wednesday night. That's when we're looking at the heaviest of rainfall, but it's really going to start even as early as Monday night and into Tuesday. And folks, it is going to rain possibly, some models are indicating, all the way into next Sunday. So we are looking at copious amounts of rain. So grab your pitch and tar and acacia wood and maybe possibly start building a kayak. Um, right ac across the state right now, we're looking at temperatures that are mild. Beautiful spring day, 64 in Little Rock, 63 in Bald Knob, 70 in El Dorado. The perfect day for washing a car, right? Isn't that how it goes if you wash a car? It's going to rain. Beautiful day for actually washing your car. Here in East End, it's 64. We've got a southeast wind of 10. You'll notice that high pressure again at 3023, so very much in control. Today, high of 71, mostly sunny, a beautiful day for completing all of the Little Rock Marathon festivities. For tonight, 51. Now you'll notice that cloud cover just beginning to move in. I'm going to call that the prelude to the deluge that's coming over the next week. For tomorrow, we'll see a 30% chance of showers late in the day. Really, almost you could say after midnight as we really begin to feel the effects of that system currently in California. Now, as far as the severe weather threat goes for Tuesday and Wednesday, we're really not looking at much here. The threat is still off towards our north and portions of Missouri and even into Oklahoma and Texas. For us, we're really looking at more of the flooding event. I'd say some roads like Sawmill or Chico or Cochran that are, are prone to flooding may be an issue during this event. You may want to go ahead and start planning your alternate route because you'll look at your extended forecast. We're looking at a 90% chance of rain Tuesday, Wednesday. It goes down just a tad bit Thursday, but it's still a lot of rain. Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Oh my gosh, it's going to rain for like the whole week. Yeah, it's going to be a lot of rain, y'all. Some models are indicating 7 to 9 inches for central Arkansas. So we're talking a lot of rain with a very low severe weather threat. So again, grab your animals two by two and maybe an oar because it is definitely going to flood in some places. So just be aware of that as you're heading out. Remember, turn around, don't drown. Be careful.